Hi everybody, this is Connie. Are you ready for an unboxing? I've got two. Um, I didn't get... I don't know what happened that I didn't get my glossy box or my... Or did I get my glossy box last week? I can't remember now. Um, but I didn't get my pop sugar in time this month. I'm not even sure if I'm going to get one this time. But I did get my Wantable and I did get my Walmart Beauty. So I'm going to open them. Um, I have not, I've just cut the tape. I have not opened anything yet. So here goes with my Walmart Beauty. This is what it looks like. This is um, $5 a season. And I think this is the fall one. Um, it just says, help define your beauty. And it's in tissue wrap. Walmart's beauty boxes have you covered all year long. Your fall box provides you with beauty products that are uniquely you and will soon be a part of your everyday routine. Remember to keep your look fresh by visiting your local Walmart, which I don't do. But um, I lied a little bit, and I told them I was a lot younger than I am so that I get the better box because I don't want the old lady's box. I want the younger box. Okay, first thing I see is the Hydro Silk Disposable Razor, which will always come in handy. And it's got a, does it have, is this a coupon or is this just tell? You could win a $500 gift card. Okay, that's not a, but it's a, it's just one of those with the, um, like the soap stuff on the side that I really, I like those kind. Okay, the next thing is that I will be passing along is a Sublime Bronze Tinted Self Tanning Lotion, which I do not do. It's a medium natural tan, instant shimmer, quick dry, streak free, 100% natural looking tan, and it's a travel size. Very cute. But I will be passing that one on. Um, I also do not use hairspray I use gel in my hair like my mom said yesterday I wish your hair didn't look wet all the time <laughs> I said mom it's gel if I didn't have gel in it it would be a poof <laughs> anyway um, this is Aussie mega hairspray to 24 hour flexible hold in one spray 24 hour hold anti humidity resistance and that's it it is in a 1.5 ounce. That's what that is. I will be passing that along also. Um, I got an ACT Advanced Care Plaque Guard Anti Gingivitis Anti Plaque Mouthwash in Clean Mint. Dentist recommended. And that I will put to good use. Um, I got a Dove Deodorant Advanced Care Beauty Finish 48 Hour. And I will put that to good use also. Some people I've heard don't really like the Dove. I, I don't mind it at all. Um, and I noticed a lot of people have been getting the mascara. I got lipstick. Yahoo! They know me, don't they? Um, and this is in 875 HD Gladiolus, I think. And it's by Revlon. It's one of their HD um, lipsticks, which I have been kind of eyeing in the store. I have not bought any. Now, my hand is kind of pink from all the lipsticks that I was doing earlier. Very pretty. Kind of a true red there. Very pretty. I like that. Um, I did change my lipstick. If you guys have been watching my my um, previous pre-made videos or pre pre-videoed, vid pre whatever. Um, I did change my lipstick to one of the new lipsticks that I got, the um, Moxie Bare Minerals Moxie Lipstick in Living Large. So pretty. It, this color is so me. I love this mauve shade. Okay, so then next I got a Nivea Extended Moisture Body Lotion. Everybody kind of knows that I don't really like um, this kind of stuff in, of these sample packs. But I will use use some of them. Um, this is a Biore, or Biore Self Heating 1 Minute Mask. And then there's a dollar coupon in there. 
I'll use that. This here is the Jergens Wet Skin Moisturizer. Locks in hydration at skin's peak moisture moment for luminous skin. Um, this one here is with refreshing coconut oil. Then there's another one with nourishing uh, manai oil. And then there's a... I don't think there's anything in this. This is just a coupon for a dollar off of that. Uh, professional Polish. Crest 3D White Brilliance. There's a step one and a step two. Fluoride toothpaste for anti-cavity and anti-gingivitis. And then there's a whitening gel, I guess. Okay. All right. And the last thing in the box is a dollar coupon on the Dove deodorant. You know, I, this box is definitely worth $5. I mean, this here, whoops, what did I do with it? This here is over $5. So, I think this box is definitely worth getting, most definitely. Um, it's always mostly all trial size. Of course, the razor wasn't trial size, and the lipstick's not trial size. Everything else was. Um, but I think it's definitely worth it. And this was not a bad box at all. Okay, now for my Wantable. And as you know, the last few months of Wantable, I've loved. I've absolutely loved the last few months. So, um, let's see. Okay, packaged especially for me. Nice to see you again, beautiful. And then there's a saying on the back, Happy Girls Are the Prettiest by Audrey Hepburn. Very nice. And then you always get this. Same picture on every one, I think. Open it up to see what's in there, which I don't want to look at just yet, but I do want to tell you about things. Then I have my brush cleaner. <laughs> I, I swipe my brushes on these after I use them, and then I can use them for an extra time. Okay. Oh, first thing I see is a kabuki brush. A little blue one. And this is by Ceta, S-E-T-A. It is a Ceta Kabu Kabu Kabuki brush. Um, this Kabuki brush is ideal for applying bronzers, blushers, powders, and shimmers flawlessly. And it retails for $18. And my price was $6.49 for it. This box is um, $30. $39, I believe. Then there is a Mica Beauty Cosmetics uh, Mineral Blush in Wild Rose. Very pretty color. Very pretty color. I'll try that out. See if I like it. Then when I first started wearing, after many years, um, I when I first started wearing makeup, I was um, wearing, was it Bare Minerals? Mineral Blush? Um, and I, that's all I ever used. And so, you know, that's how I kind of got used to wearing blush. So, you know, I, I like mineral blush. I just don't use it much anymore. This is an Ofra Long Lasting Liquid Lipstick. Oh, by the way, that um, Mica Beauty Mineral Blush Wild Rose. This mineral blush offers a beauty beautiful hint of color that can be applied to the cheeks and temples for a healthy translucent glow sweep thin layers of blush from the apple of your cheeks to the hairline and this $55 this retails for and I paid $19.82 for it wow okay and this lipstick all shades contain antioxidants and vitamin C or vitamin E, while the formula provides a lightweight layer. Ooh, is it purple? I think I'll be passing this one on. Uh, lightweight layer of lasting color to make you feel fresh all day. Color will last in a perfect condition. And this is $19 retail, and I paid $6.85. Holy mackerel, is that purple? Um, yeah, I, I think this it was swatched 
and I think that's about all that I'll do with it because I'm just I am not a purple you know I love purple but I just don't think purple looks good on me for lipsticks okay then here we go Mirabella must be a color palette apricot awakening this trio includes tones of apricot honey and medium brown style tip use all three tones for a perfect look this retails for $19 and I paid $6.85 so so my price was $40 for the box I since I'm keeping it all um, I got a credit of $4 so that's $36 so in this box um, collection was $111 so that's not bad. So I always have such trouble opening these darn things. Come on. Ugh. Oh, wow. Pretty. I will swatch them for you. Oh, very soft feeling. Um, except for the brown, it feels a little powdery. There you go. Oh, so pretty. Those will really be pretty together. Wow, that will really make a pretty eye color. I like that. I'm happy with that. So again... Um, not out of the park. I am. I like the blush and I like the eye palette. The lipstick um, I could have done with a different color, and the kabuki brush I could care less about. Um, I don't like kabuki brushes. I don't know why. I just don't like these little brushes. I just I will never use it. So I will probably pass that along. Also, it's very soft, very pretty too. I love this color, but um, not as good this month as it was last month. I don't think the box but still um, I'm very happy with the eyeshadows um, of course I haven't worn them yet and I'm very happy or I'm happy with the the blush um, haven't tried it yet of course but I will so anyway but that um, purple that is just way too purple for me way too dark but I you know what I might try it on and see how it looks because you know I don't know um, I don't want to give it away without trying it first. If it was orange or something, I would definitely just give it away. But being, I don't know how it's going to look, so I'll try it. So anyway, that's my two boxes. Um, I'm happy, really actually happy with both of them. I usually figure if I'm happy with um, two or three of the four items in my want to a box, that's a pretty good deal. Um, you know, you can't be happy with everything every single time. They're not going to get it right every time. But they did, the colors were great on the the um, the eyeshadow palette. And I do like triple eyeshadow palettes because three is usually all I ever use on my eyes. Um, so, and I do like all three colors. I do like the color on the blush. I'll have to see it on my cheeks to actually know for sure if I like it. The lipstick, eh. Um, we'll see. Like I said. The kabuki brush, eh. The, um... Walmart box, most everything was pretty good. There's a few things that I'll pass along, but it's definitely worth $5. The um, lipstick alone pays for the whole box. So there you go. And if you like my unboxings, please let me know. Um, if there's anything I want you want me to do differently, let me know that also. I'm, I'm certainly up for suggestions. So if you like these kind of things, these unboxings, please give me a thumbs up, and I'll see you in my next video. Bye-bye.